The best cafe in the world! <laughs> I'm Little Cook Small and... Hang on, where's Big Cook Ben? He should be back with the shopping by now. Oh, hello everyone. Hello Small. Oh, I've just been out shopping. Did you get everything on the shopping list? I think so. <laughs> you didn't use that bag, did you Ben? Everything falls out of the holes. It looks more like a spider's web than a shopping bag. <laughs> Nothing's fallen out of the shopping bag today, Small. Let's have a check. Hey, you can help too. Four oranges. Let's see. One. Two. Three. Oh, I'll count again. Why don't you join in and count with me? One. Two. Three. Hmm. But there should be four oranges, Ben. There's one missing. Let's see if we can find it. It's round and orange. Can you spot it? Is it by the saucepans? No. Is it by the cups? No. Oh, I found it, I found it. Is this it, Small? <laughs> It's orange. <laughs> That's a feather duster, Ben. Ooh. We use that to get rid of the spider's webs in the corner. Spider's webs? There's no spider's webs in our cafe, Small. I think I've found the orange. <laughs> well done, Ben. You found the orange. Let's see what else we needed. Butter. Butter, got that. A wooden spoon. One wooden spoon. And that's everything. Um, Ben, we also needed chocolate. That must have fallen out of the bag. Well, um, the, the, the chocolate didn't fall out of the bag, Small. <laughs> well, where is it then, Ben? But I, I, I ate it. <laughs> <laughs> you ate all the chocolates? <laughs> Come on, Small, we've got a customer. I'm on my way. Woohoo! Who is it? Who's in our cafe, Small? See if you can guess, Ben. She's frightened of spiders. <laughs> oh, she doesn't need to be frightened of spiders. And she eats curds and whey. Eats curds and whey and is frightened of spiders. Oh, I know. Do you? It's Little Miss Muffet. <laughs> little Miss Muffet sat on her tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider and sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. Oh. Oh, she must get very bored of eating curds and whey. That's a sort of milky pudding. Perhaps she's come to our cafe to try something different. I think you're right, Little Cook. But what would Miss Muffet like to eat? I think it's time to look in my book. <laughs> We need a story to help us cook. Let's take a look in Little Cook's book. Little Cook's Adventures in the Big World. Let me see. Little Miss Muffet sat on her tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider that sat down beside her and frightened Miss Muffet away. So, Miss Muffet had run away, leaving the spider all alone and looking very sad indeed. I happened to be passing by when I saw the unhappy spider. I asked him why he looked so glum. Well, sniffed the spider, people always run away when they see me. Sometimes they even scream. It's ever so lonely being a spider. I'm sure Miss Muffet wouldn't run away from you, I told the spider. She's always so friendly. Let's go and meet her. We found Miss Muffet busy in her kitchen. 
Hello, little cook, said Miss Muffet. Have you popped by for a cup of tea? Yes, I replied, but I also want you to meet my new friend. And I introduced Miss Muffet to the spider. My spider friend is worried that you are scared of him because you ran away earlier. Miss Muffet laughed. No, I wasn't running away. I just sat down to eat my bowl of curds and whey, she said to the spider, when I remembered I'd left some cakes cooking in the oven. I rushed back to the kitchen to take them out before they burnt. I'm so sorry you thought I was running away from you. The spider smiled. And Miss Muffet invited us all for tea. We had a lovely time chatting and eating her delicious cakes. And I hear that Miss Muffet and the spider have become the best of friends and often spend the afternoons laughing at how they met. Little Cook to the rescue once again! That was a great adventure! Hey! Little Miss Muffet sat on a tuffet, eating her curds and whey. Along came a spider and sat down beside her. Hello, said Miss Muffet. Please stay. Way! That's exactly what Miss Muffet would say to the spider, Ben. Yes, but what would Miss Muffet like to eat as a treat? Hmm. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. <gasps> I know! Big Cook's Big Cookery Book. Of course, the big cookery book. There's recipes for everything in there. And where do we look for things to cook? In the book, in the book, in Big Cook's book. Oh, yes, here it is. The perfect thing for Little Miss Muffet. Noodle webs. It looks just like a spider's web. Come on, then, Small. You read out the ingredients and I'll see if we've got them. OK, let's see. We're going to need a spider's web. Spider's <laughs> web? <laughs> <laughs> Are you teasing me, Small? <laughs> Come on, what's really in the recipe? Well, it's a long list. Here goes. We're going to need a spring onion. OK, over to the fridge. In here, spring onion. Got that, Small? A pepper. Pepper, yes. Oh, lovely and yellow. Got the pepper. A tomato. Tomatoes. All red and juicy, tomato. Tinned pineapple. In the cupboard. Here we are. Tin pineapple, yep. Oil. Oil, OK. Got that, Small. Soy sauce. Soy sauce, oh, yes. Very nice soy sauce. Ketchup. Ketchup. Oh, bright and red, yep. And noodles. Noodles. There we go. Brilliant. Everything we need for the recipe. It's a long list. We haven't made anything with noodles before, Ben. I wonder how they're made. Hey, why don't you whiz off and find out, little cook, and I'll get everything ready. That's a great idea, Ben. See you later. <laughs> hey, why don't you come too? <laughs> go small, go small, whiz away. I wonder what he'll see today. There's a train! Choo-choo! I'm in the right place here. Wow, that's an enormous bag of flour. All the ingredients have to be put into a big mixer, ready to be mixed together. Mixy mixy! It takes a long time to mix it all up. 
Now the mixture is ready to be turned into noodles. <laughs> it's all crumbly. <gasps> wow, this machine has turned the crumbly mixture into a long, smooth, flat dough. The dough is being cut into long, thin strings. Noodles! Noodles are used a lot in Chinese cooking. Oh, that's a big tray. A tray full of noodles. Noodles are fun. See you later. They're small. You made me jump then. <laughs> Did you have a good time? It was brilliant. I saw how noodles are made. It's a good job I didn't bring them back in your string bag, Ben. They would have fallen through the holes. <laughs> <laughs> no time for giggling now, Small. It's time to get cooking. We're all ready, so take a look and we will show you how to cook. <laughs> Jelly boats and pirates go, Princess Peach. Pies, carrot cakes and fruity smiles As envelope surprise We love our cafe and we love to cook We have a fantastic recipe book He is big cook and he is small Friends in our cafe we cook for them all When your tummy gets all rumbly You're ready for a treat you can make something delicious to eat. Have you cleaned the surfaces? Yes. Have you washed your hands? Yes. All, All clean, clean and, and ready, ready to, to cook. cook. Do you remember the ingredients to Noodle Web? You do. There was a spring onion. One. Chopped. A pepper. Half sliced. A tomato. One chopped. Tinned pineapple. A few chunks. Oil. One tablespoon. Soy sauce. One tablespoon. Ketchup. One tablespoon. And noodles. One packet. Whoopee! Let's get started! Now, I've already heated the oil in a frying pan, so I'm going to add to that the tomatoes. Sizzling away. The pineapple chunks. Soy sauce and the tomato ketchup. There we are. And I'll stir it all around for a couple of minutes. Oh, it smells very nice. What's next, Small? You've got to boil a kettle and pour the water over the noodles. That's good, because I've already boiled this water here. So, pop in the noodles and pour on the water. In it goes. There we are. And this is another job for your grown-up helper to do, because remember, it's hot, hot, hot. On goes the lid. They're crunchy now, but they'll go soft in the water. It says you need to leave them for five minutes, so I'll set the timer. Woohoo! The noodles should be soft by now, Ben. Yes, and now I'm going to drain off the water through a colander. Mind they don't fall through the holes like the things did in your string bag. <laughs> The noodle webs look best on a dark plate. I've drained these now, so I'm going to arrange them on the plate to look like a spider's web. There we are. Some there. 
and a few more around here and I'm just going to break them up a little Whee! <laughs> what are you doing small? Skipping with a noodle! It fell off your plate Ben! Skipping's very good exercise you're supposed to be helping me. Oh, sorry, Ben. Now, I've poured the sauce into a little pot and I'm going to place that on the plate, just in the middle of the spider's web. There. Then we'll take the spring onion and I'll put two slices on the sauce, one there and one there, as our spider's eyes. <laughs> that looks great. Yes, it does. And I'll use the rest of the spring onion to just sprinkle around the outside. Brilliant. And now we can use our eight slices of pepper as the spider's legs, because spiders have eight legs. Count with me. One, two, three, four, and on this side, five, six, seven, eight. Brilliant! Yes, it is. Let's hope Miss Muffet likes it. One noodle web coming through. There, all done. So what do we do now? Can we play? Not yet. Time to clean and put away. Hooray! Wash, wipe, scrub and clean Make the kitchen sparkle and gleam My name's Ben And my name's Small We've got the cleanest kitchen of all Tidy all the bits and bobs The things that help us do our job Ingredients well put away Ready for use another day Pots and pans will start to smell If we don't wash them really well And now it's clear, let's all smile We'll be finished in a little while All around, up and down We've got the cleanest cafe in town Aha, here comes the plate Oh, yes. See, I told you Miss Muffet wasn't scared of spiders. And look, Small, she's left a note. Well, what does it say? What does it say? Let's see, shall we? It says, Dear Big Cook Ben and Little Cook Small, my noodle web was delicious. Whee! <laughs> it made a tasty change from curds and whey. I hear you're having a problem with your string shopping bag. And to say thank you, Here's a little something that may help. What is it, Ben? Oh, oh, look, Small. It's a brand new shopping bag. It hasn't got any holes in it, and it's got a lovely picture of a spider on the front. Oh, brilliant. Let's go shopping. Hey, hey. see you soon. See you soon. Woohoo! <laughs> Welcome to our cafe. Big cook, little cook. We'll cook for him. 